Hello everyone and welcome to this video on batteries. A bit different than they normally are, but here we go. Over time many have asked if batteries with more milliamp hours than standard were fake and if it was even possible to get extra battery life by using one of these batteries. In this video I decided to find out and do a video following the process, so let's get the test started. So we will test an original 1715 milliamp hour Apple battery with default specs. The middle one is a boosted 2200 milliamp hour battery from Ockert. And the last one is a 2580 milliamp hour battery from Shenmitz. So the original Apple battery as we have seen in my previous Geekbench battery test lasts around 3 hours and 20 minutes. The Ockert battery promises a 29% increase in battery life and the Shenmets should then come with a little calculation to a whopping 50% increase in battery life. Now let's look at the details of these batteries using 3U tools. Note that these screenshots were taken after I installed the batteries and charged them to 100%. So a few things to note here are that all of them are made by Dsay, which is a known Apple battery manufacturer, so that's a positive. But it is interesting to note that the boosted batteries both have a lower design capacity than the stock Apple battery does. And also note that the Shenmets battery does not have an actual capacity that is higher than the Ockert battery, which is kind of strange when they promise 2580 milliamp hours. Also note that the production date is 2015 for the 2580 milliamp hour battery, so maybe something's fishy with that one. But let's see what the test will say. So how do I run this test? So first I install the new zero cycle battery in the iPhone. I'm using the same iPhone every time, I'm just replacing the battery between each shoot. So when the battery is installed I charge it to 100% and then let it sit for a minimum of 2 extra hours to ensure that it is fully charged. Then finally I drain the battery using the battery test of Geekbench 4. This test runs a series of tasks that stress the processor during the test. For more information on this check in the video description where I have a full description from Geekbench on how the battery test works. And finally I collect and review the results. So first I will install the Apple battery and then run the test. I will not be showing the installation process of the other batteries as it is pretty much as you're seeing right now. So all the recordings are done, I have them here side by side, so let's see how these batteries perform. Let's run the test. Oh, 
So the results are in, let's launch Geekbench and review the scores. 1970 points for the Apple battery, 2480 for the Augert and 2098 for the Shenmets battery. The clear winner for sure is the Augert. So to conclude on this test, can you buy a battery that extends your battery life beyond that of the original battery? The answer seems to be yes, but you have to be careful. Batteries advertised does not always live up to the promised milliamp hours as we have seen in this test, nor are they as stable as you would want them to be, as we saw with the 2580 milliamp hour battery that in this test shut down at 13%. But it was also clear that the 2200 milliamp hour battery outperformed the standard battery by 51 minutes or almost 26%. If I were to go with one of these batteries, it would be the 2200 milliamp hour battery from Augert. It adds 26% life to a device in a Geekbench test, which is not bad at all. So just want to put in there that this is not a sponsored video by any means, and uh, you also need to be careful when you add one of these batteries to your iPhone. I have no idea how they perform on a long-term basis. So that's it for this video, thank you very much for watching. If you have comments to this video or suggestions to other videos that I could do, put them in the comments below. And it really helps keep the motivation going when you subscribe to the channel, share the video and like it. Thank you very much, take care. Was the microphone off? Okay, so we will just leave that b-roll in there and let the video run for a few more minutes. No? Shouldn't we? I don't know. Let's cut it. No, let's leave it. No. Leave it. Cut it. Okay, we'll leave it. Yeah, let's leave it. Okay, we'll leave it. Okay, left. Over. Out.